Okay, today we're gonna work on plantar flexion sits and lifts. So uh, everybody wants to talk about ankle dorsiflexion. We also need to make sure we have plantar flexion, which is pointing your toes. So Seth is simply going to sit back on his heels, making sure that his heels stay pointed at the ceiling. If you look at me and if you let those heels just kind of spill out, you're not quite accessing plantar flexion. You got a couple other motions going. So first, we want to make sure, can somebody sit back comfortably on their heels? Their heels should be touching their hips. What we'll see on a lot of people is they'll still maintain a space underneath the shin. You can see Seth has decent uh, mobility here, even though he said he was feeling a little bit tight, it looks pretty good. Now, if we, <laughs> I heard a grunt also. Now we're gonna make it active. So he's gonna put his hands out in front of his knees a couple inches, and now he's going to actively lift from the dorsum or the top of his foot until his knees are fully extended, and now he's gonna control it back down. Perfect, we're gonna do one more and control it back down. Awesome. So again, we go from a passive mobility drill to an active mobilization, and those are plantar flexion sits and lifts.